We have a diluter demand, a pressure demand, and then we have we also have just continuous flow. So the diluter demand and the pressure demand, those are systems that you're typically going to see in pressurized aircraft, and they're going to be some sort of emergency backup in the case of a depressurization event. The reason we need this is actually a physiological reason, and we'll, we'll go back and talk about in 61107 why we need that, but just to cover it here, the, at higher altitudes, we have a lower partial pressure of oxygen. So the oxygen down here is kind of being pressurized into our lungs. I know you don't feel like it's being pressurized, but we're at the bottom of this great big atmosphere. And so it's kind of forcing the air, the oxygen molecules into our lungs. And at higher altitudes, it's not that there's less oxygen. There's the same proportional amount at altitude as there is down here, it's that there's less pressure. So it's not getting pushed into our lungs like it is down here. So up at 12,000 feet, for instance, in order to get the same percentage of oxygen into our blood, we need to be breathing in a higher percentage of oxygen.